Welcome back to the Evil Within 2. Let's progress north. And to start that, I want to check out these derailed train cars. Oh, I could probably use another bottle too. Nails. These long stainless steel nails are the kind typically used in construction. They make great shrapnel. Uh, probably for some sort of like grenade or explosive device of some sort. <laughs> uh oh. Screw you. I'm not wasting my ammo on you. The old car trick. Come on, come back this way. Come on. Come back this way. I dare you. Please don't go around the other way. Oh, come on, what are you doing? You're not even gonna investigate? Come on. Gotcha. I'm getting a little bit better with bottles. Why is there goo there? Is someone just going around all of Union, or the entire simulation, or whatever the hell this is, just taking pictures of dead bodies? Oh. Pouch upgraded. And got ammo 26. Nice. That was an odd sound. Oh. What the fuck? A trap triggered? That is what that is, right? Do I just have to trigger it? Do 
hell? What was that? Some sort of a weird trap to catch me dying, I guess, on film. But I mean, why did it just appear out of nowhere? Alright, I remember there were some boxes over there I broke, which means there must be a way into this train. Fuck. <laughs> was that supposed to be scary? That was just hilarious. <laughs> 24 green gel, what the hell? Smoke powder. Dry powder emits a plume of smoke when exposed to flames. This component can be used to craft useful items. Bread flour? I'm gonna burn flour. I'd rather make bread with it. I'm over it. Mysterious mask. Looks like something from Dishonored. Oh, you feel like you've seen this before, but you can't quite put your finger on when or where that was. But at any rate, it looks pretty cool, so you decide to keep it in your room. I think I saw a tweet about this. Or an object like that. I think it was a reference to uh, one of the Wolfenstein games. I don't know if that one in particular is. These train cars go on for a long time.
Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Oh, wow, there's three of them. I'm getting off this train. Come on, come on, come on. You know, I haven't tried to use this yet. Maybe I should try it out. It's supposed to be silent. I wonder if it could harpoon multiple enemies at the same time, if it would go through multiple enemies, if they're lined up with each other. Last one, hold to adjust range. I think it saw me. That's a pretty good tactic, actually. You can get them to kind of see you, but not become so aware of you that you can't do a stealth kill. That actually worked out really well. Because it's got a much further range than a bottle. Give me that goo. There's one more. Where did it go off to? I don't even hear it. Did it go back asleep? It did. Oh, there goes my axe. I've already gone pretty far north. Oh. We're near one of the rogue, rogue signals, which I think will have probably one of those Mobius agents that have gone rogue.
red gel. Oh, that's what you use to upgrade or uh, unlock some of the further branches. Kind of like the advanced weapon parts. I see it. The Nern root. Oh. I'm getting a lot better at stealth. A steel pipe with some rust on the ends, not worth much as a cudgel. Besides, you've got guns. Good for crafting. That's all I wanted. Alright, so how close am I to... Uh, it's right there. Alright, I'm gonna go to it. What's that? Oh, Union Auto Repair. I'm close to the uh, sniper. Well, sort of close. Sniper rifle parts. Cash is overrun with those things. Supplies of it. Supposed to get supplies of it. Supplies of it. Oh, that's just indicating that was in the area. Right. Oh. Looks like a monster. Well, I guess not. I see smoke. Here we go. I need this worse than you do, pal. Not gonna waste my ammo on you. Uh, 
have any bottles? One. Ah, damn it. Let me see if I can get her to sight me a bit. Just a little tease that I'm here. Some juicy meat. They really don't care about the flashlight too much. There. You're so close, come on, come here, come here. Stop walking into the car, come here into my blade. Laser sighted handgun. Semi automatic pistol has been equipped with a laser sight for improved accuracy at longer ranges. I'm assuming that uses the same type of ammo? Yeah, looks like it. Hmm. So I don't see any sort of a stats menu for these weapons. I'm assuming that means they do the same damage. I know they have different functions. Like this one's more accurate, this one is a burst fire. Unless we can like look at it in the inventory. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about damage. So I'm just going to assume they're all the same damage, in which case... In which case, why would I not use the laser-sided handgun? Seems to hold less ammo. Oh, it has its own upgrade tree, doesn't it? I was upgrading only this specific type of pistol when I was upgrading it. Not just all pistols, I think. Unless I just need to load it with more rounds. Let's assign the laser sighted to number two. So I got the normal one here. And this is laser sighted. Oh, it, yeah, it does hold seven. Okay, so the upgrade is for all pistols. I feel like that laser is going to help a lot. I just hope, I just hope they can't see the laser. Surely they can, right? Zzz. Oh, that one's alive. Looking at the stars. To bet it's overcast. Just out of curiosity, I'm going to try shooting this just with one round. 
Okay. So this is the place, right? Yeah. get in that place. <laughs> Ew! Dispenses brain juice? I mean, I'm just gonna keep hitting it, right? There's got to be a catch, right? Duh. Nice stuff inside there. Why is that... the truck shaking? Something in that truck. Like, I know I can shoot them, but can I do a stealth kill when they're not awake yet? They're gonna wake up. Like, you really can't just knife them? I guess I'll just ignore him for now. That's the street. Bunch of them there. All right, I'm gonna go this way. I'll I'll come back to this area. Whoa. Oh, Christ. Gotta be a break in the fence somewhere. Oh shit. Think I'm okay.
Okay. Alright. Guess maybe one of them did see me and was actually coming over the whole time. If I threw a bottle, would they... Oh, they're locked in there. They couldn't get out anyway. Oh, no. I'm holding hands with a hand. Did somebody put that there as a joke? I bet somebody did. I could catch on fire down there, but I don't think I have anything to catch it on fire with. Unless shooting it would catch it on fire? Maybe? Probably not. I know what that one is. I think that's one of the encounters I saw someone do when they were playing through the game and I was watching. <laughs> There's another one. I think that one's also from Wolfenstein. to a power source or something. Gotcha. Let me see if I can get them to spot me. I think it did just spot me. No! Fuck me! <laughs> a 
Hunter going back. Roar. I should probably just assign bottles to a number, huh? There. Handgun. Bottles. Are you serious? Yeah, why don't you come on back to where you were before? What was that noise? I probably don't need to throw a bottle. Is there anything in the tutorial about how to light it? Nope, just says kick it to spill the oil. I killed that one, right? Yeah, just disconcerting that the eyes are still glowing. Oh, look at that, I think the the power lines are rustling in the wind, I think. Is that an openable door?
Oh yeah, that's a thing I'm going to be able to open once I get the power back on. I can move it? Guess just help me get up here? Yeah. Okay, it just falls off. <laughs> it just falls off. I thought they would break it open, but it literally just fell off. Nice and easy. Alright, that works. Did the trick. It's a pretty big building. And I'm pretty close to the safe house. And I'm also kind of low on health. I know I could just use a med kit, but I'd rather just go back and get some coffee. So I'm gonna head back to the safe house, grab some coffee, save it, and I'll be right back. Let's go ahead and spend my green gel while I'm here. First thing I absolutely want, really badly, Prowler 1, move faster, walk crouched. From 100 to 125%, 25% increase in crouch speed. And let's also go for increase the stamina gauge to 120%. A lot of the like first tier stuff is pretty cheap. There's probably some other cheap things to get. Like steady hands, reduce reticle sway when firing weapon, sure, super cheap. Can't quite afford that one. Can't quite afford that one either. But yeah, I'll get a lot of the early tier stuff, because it's just so cheap. Let's also upgrade our pistol. Got a bunch of weapon parts. Oh yeah, I can also upgrade this thing. I should probably try this thing out. I still have not even shot it a single time. Better range would be nice. Oh, 40% distance increase for only 25 weapon parts. Sure. Shock Bolt. Effect chains to more enemies over a greater distance. So it sounds like it would be pretty good for crowd control. Well, especially if you upgrade it. But for now, let's look at the pistol again. I've still only got the one high-grade weapon parts. I feel like the pistol is going to be pretty important. I'm going to use it. Oh, that's 200 weapon parts. Increase the probability of inflicting critical damage when shooting an enemy's weak point from 1% to 30%. That's big. Probably nothing we can get for 20 weapon parts. 
30. Oh. Decrease the amount of time it takes to reload. Okay. It's a sizable increase for a really cheap price. Do we need ammo? Yeah, we could use some. Ah, oh, so the capacitors for the shock bolts. Got 103. Yeah, let's craft... Uh, let's go with 8. Let's get up to 20. Alright, I'll meet you back where I was before. Alright, let's open this thing. Before that, though, let's look at our new crouch speed. That's a lot faster. There's gonna be something nasty in here. Was oh, that a person that died? Not a monster? What did they just die from? Look at that neck. <laughs> Note to self, it matters which direction you kick it over. So I'm gonna waste one shot just to see if this will light it on fire. Okay, that's big. Good to know. God, that looks gorgeous. I mean, it looks like it's pointing to go through here, but how? Can I shoot it? I don't get it. Do I need leverage, or can I just use a recycler charge? If you haven't seen my Prey playthrough, that's a Prey joke. Is there something I can climb? I can't seem to climb anything in here. I mean, can I shoot the chain through the chain lake fence? I, I don't get it. Maybe there's something obvious here that I just am seriously missing. It really seems like you're supposed to go this way. Maybe there's a tool I'll get later that will allow me to break that? I can't knife it. I can't shoot it. I even tried shooting it with uh, a uh, bolt from this thing, which reminds me I should put that on the quick use key. Number four. Yeah, I even tried shooting it with one of these. Did not work. Maybe I need an axe or something? I don't know. And I can't jump up anywhere. I'm just gonna leave, I guess. I'll come back here at some point. Where should we go next? Perhaps... 
over here. Ah, uh, that looks like a ramp. I think we gotta go all the way around. Oh, it's just right here. Yeah, I haven't quite explored this area. I went in there and up on the roof, but haven't been here. Ooh, there's an axe. I'm gonna go try that back there. See if that will break it open. Just after I rummage around in the garbage. Alright, let's try it. Come on. Ah, the great Sebastian Castiano stopped by a thin plywood board. Can't even break it down with an axe. What a sad, sad person you are. Yeah, they even specifically disabled climbing up on things, I guess, to stop you from trying to get over. Because, like, these you could normally climb, but I can't climb them, can't climb any of this. Okay. Alright, let's check this place out. Wright and Sons Discount Law Office. <laughs> discount Law. Oh. There's the rockin' truck. Oh right, this is where all the people are just, like, sleeping for some reason. And by people I mean monsters. You know, I was going to go over here, but so much for that. I'd like to mention he just put a massive, massive like plastic tub of gunpowder in his back pocket and yet this person can hold more than what like 25 pistol rounds Sebastian okay we could just walk in there but 
What if instead... We just did this. Hmm? One of them's got fire. Oh, why do I keep doing this? I have it on quick menu. Oh shit. Uh. I gotta say, now that I've actually learned how to do stealth, plus I'm not sure how much of it's learning how to do stealth better and how much of it's just that ambush ability. I think it's kind of both, but with those two combined, stealth is actually really fun now. Before it was just like painstaking. But now I can ambush, now I can understand bottles better. Now my crouched movement speed is 25% better. So it's not quite so horrendously slow. It's a lot more fun. Is that... Oh, it's shotgun rounds. Wait a minute. Wait, that's a quick time of like sort of a quick time event. Mash E to open it. What if you fail that? I'm just not gonna mash it. <laughs> it just drops it. Dang, I was hoping he would like pinch his fingers in it or something. Or like it would fall on his feet and hurt you. presence in the chimney. Still seriously creeped out by all these sleeping monsters. I couldn't wake him up with a knife, but what about this? Okay, sure it's it's dead, I believe you. That's the entrance to the shop. I couldn't find an entrance on the back of the front. There it is. Oh, this thing's so gonna burst open. Oh, I was gonna say it burst open when I went inside or came out or something, but it looks like I can just straight up open it. All right. This is gonna be a terrible idea. Hi.
Oh shit, I can't actually hide behind that thing. Can I ambush from bushes? I'm not technically in cover, like, holding space. I should be able to move fast enough to catch up to him, though. When they turn around, I think. Oh, there's a face on their back. Ew. Well, the rest of them seem to have dispersed. I'm assuming the one by the side of it still hasn't woken up now. things. Don't want to go inside until I've taken these out, I think. Oh man, there's three of them. That one's real, unlike the other one. Roar! 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 <laughs> I love them, they're so cute. Roar! 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 They're trying their best. I'd like to get their attention so that they'd like jump over the fence for me and then I hide somewhere but the question is where do I hide? I guess I could hide like here. Yeah, alright. Okay, definitely saw me. Yep, here they come. They kind of look at you and make a bit of a noise when they, like, half spot you. They might have seen me. There we go, there we go. That worked really well. The others might be too far to see me. Here we go. As long as they don't say roar, I think we're okay. Hmm. They're looking, but they're not coming over? Dang. Come on, there we go. Oh shit, they might just full on spot me. No, oh, nope, they didn't quite spot me.
The last one, I think I'm just gonna go in and get him. Actually, mm, no, they didn't spot me. Not gonna help me get out. How come they can climb the fences, but I can't? Whoa! What? You can do that? Okay, that's pretty sweet. <laughs> I don't know when I'd want to do that. I mean, it is certainly faster than climbing up on the thing. Can you do it on any car? <laughs> Alright, let's go inside. Please don't close. the basement. So wait, were they fiddling with this thing? Is this a minigame? Oh, you're supposed to get the exact number of lights without going over or under. Oh. That... What a weird minigame. Oh, 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 oh. Holy shit, that... Oh, what the... F fuck, that one's different. The fuck is that thing? That one's not all bubbly. doesn't even die from a sneak attack with a knife. Guess that was a mini boss or something. Well, probably not quite a mini boss. Something up in that car.
What the? What's this? Uh. That's not the way down, right? Didn't it come from here? Is this... I mean, this isn't a basement. That thing came out of here. It didn't even come out of the basement, I guess. Are there even worse things down there? Oh, Christ. Here we go. And the ladder to get out of here is broken, of course. Is that an apple? Ah, so this whole place is a secret cache that was unknown to the person who actually owned this place. Oh, I need to actually know it, huh? Ah, uh, they see you. Security guard shows a grid of authentication codes used to access secure Mobius locations. What the? Uh. What's this? Some kind of cipher? The fuck? Ah. Come on! We got each other at the same time. Alright, well, I'm trapped down here, so I should probably heal myself. What do I have for med supplies again? I'm actually, I'm just gonna use a med kit because I know there's a med kit out there in the truck. a ladder out of this place, maybe? What do we got here? Hmm? Cattle prod? Oh, explosive bolt. The warhead on this crossbow bolt will violently explode when activated, releasing damaging shrapnel into the surrounding area. You don't want to be near it when it goes off. Report 00592, disposal request. Uh, for Mobius Operative 073, Union designation Ted Sisson. 
incident report uh, at approximately 1430 citizen blah 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 union designation Jonathan Stevens entered an unauthorized Mobius area and witnessed sensitive materials capture and reprogramming was unfortunately not an option was forced to institute Zeta 5 emergency measures Cresting disposal unit union auto repair well I should be able to open this door over here Can't move these or anything, right? No. <laughs> I can't fit through here, right? No. Okay. Let's see if we can get a better look at that. Um, where would it be? Is it in my inventory? Key items? Yeah. Mm. I'm not sure what to do with that. A through E and 1 through 5. Well, it says B34. And it's four digits. B3 would be two digits. B4 would be another, so maybe it's B3 and then B4. Let's hope that's right. So, B3 and then B4, so 96, 76. Oh, it shows you a pop up, cool. Yeah, I got it. I feel smart. Hello. High grade weapon parts. Nice. <laughs> There's another med kit. I just wanted to kick that again. I see a trap. Is there really just no way to, like, disarm it? I mean, I can't jump, so I can't go over it. I see a thing there. Is that an ex. Whoa. Hi. Well, they're probably going to trigger an explosive when they go through here. So, oh, no, 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 no. So, how about this? Hey, everybody, come over here. See ya. She didn't even hear it, did she? I wish I could just, like, whistle. I guess I could just shoot my gun. Did they not hear that? Wait, I think they saw me. Yep, 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 yep. Uh oh, I'm not gonna be able to do a sneak kill. Oh no, I can? I thought you weren't allowed to do that if they spotted you. They even roared and everything. Wait, so hitting the trigger just triggered the trigger to be able to trigger? What? I don't understand. Just give me that.
give me a lot of these explosive bolts. Okay, I've like never used this thing. How about I try it? So... It sh if it's if I can put it to a place where it's gonna like connect between two things, it'll show me like this. All right. Really is dis disconcerting just how glowy all the ammo for this thing is. Well, any way you cut it, when they come here, they should they should explode. Are you serious? Okay. I'll take it. Oh, they're not even dead. Okay. There we go. Are you gonna wake up now? It's got glowy eyes. Ah, oh, well. Let's see if I can do it. Ah, oh, dang. It's too high. Okay, well, this episode is hellaciously long, so I think this is a pretty good place to end. I'm just gonna run back to the uh, safe house and, and save. I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, I'm going to head even further north.